businesses and even our lives are increasingly dependent on computing technology. It helps us to work more productively. It enables products and services that were not possible before. In an increasingly complex world, a multidisciplinary education is immensely valuable. The SMU Bachelor of Science Computing and Law program provides a rare opportunity to be trained in two intellectually demanding disciplines that will prepare graduates well for a fast-changing world. The practice of law is changing and it is going to continue to change. We are already doing things like using artificial intelligence to enhance our due diligence capabilities, to do things faster for clients. We are already doing document automation and we are already creating software that helps our clients do what they want to do. So clearly, we need people with different skill sets. What has happened lately is that increasingly the role of computing and the, the legal aspects around that are starting to come together. But it's good for us to start to prepare people for an environment where that might happen. I see two or three different areas where students who take this kind of a degree can then proceed in terms of building their careers. They could understand how computing will work in law. They will be able to accelerate a full law degree, but will have a grounding in computing. The second is that certainly large technology firms and many other firms are going to require legal specialization that understands how computers work. And the third area, I think, is that increasingly law firms are also relying on a lot of data, on a lot of technology. So they will be looking for people that have some sort of understanding of the law, but also have skills around computing and around technology. In relation to the law and technology, we recognise that the legal profession is being changed rapidly by technology. The uh, governance issues arising from artificial intelligence. The curriculum is more than just a simple collection of computing and law courses. Instead, we relate law concepts to technology application contexts. We are able to do that because we have professors from the computing school and law school who work on the intersection of both disciplines. It's an incredibly exciting time to become a legal technologist. Um, the sector is undergoing a lot of changes at the moment globally and of course here in Singapore. Technology data and analytics are really changing the way lawyers operate um, and how to deliver legal services to their clients. But it's also enabling lawyers to really offer new kinds of services, new business models to their clients and really bringing um, more and more value to them. It's really important to train a new breed of legal technologists who will have the skills, the tools, but also the language to bridge the gap between law and technology. That creates a lot of opportunities for young, bright, technical talent to come and play a part in the transformation of our legal sector. The thought of a joint degree or a degree that combines um, that clarity of thought that traditionally a legal education has given you, together with the analytical skills that a computing education will give you, now that's what I call a course that really is preparing people for the challenges of the future.